Hi, I'm Lisa. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this delicious fish pie to highlight Celiac Awareness Week. In my large frying pan add the coconut oil. You can actually use butter if you prefer but I like the benefits of coconut oil. Then add in my leeks. I want to saute these so they're nice and soft. Add in sea salt, white pepper and garlic granules. And when they're really nice and soft, I'm going to remove them from the frying pan, add them into a bowl, and then just scatter over some fresh dill. So let that infuse while I carry on making the remainder of my fish pie. So now I'm going to get my poaching liquor on. I'm going to make here a bouquet garni. This actually just gives it flavor to the liquid. So what you need to do is place the leek on the base, then add the celery and then add the dill. So I've got my almond milk here, which I'm going to add into my large frying pan. I've got a whole onion, which has been quartered, so I'm just going to add that into the almond milk. Bouquet garni goes in, pop that in there. So I'm going to add in my cod here. Salmon goes in, and we're actually just going to start the cooking process in the milk. Let me know about your gluten-free recipes on Twitter using hashtag glutenfreeweek. So now my um, fish has been poaching for five minutes. I'm going to remove the fish with a slotted spoon onto a resting plate. Just turn off the heat and leave the almond milk to infuse with the onion and the bouquet garni. After 10 minutes, remove the onion and the bouquet garni. Then what you need to do is just strain the sauce just in case any bits of onion or dill have come through. Now I'm going to make the creamy sauce for the fish pie. So in my saucepan I've got some more coconut oil and I'm going to add in corn flour. So usually to thicken a sauce you'd be using plain flour to make a roux for the sauce but I'm actually using corn flour which is gluten free. So I'm going to add that in. So when it thickens up move it from the heat and then gradually pour in your strained almond milk and continuously whisking. And then I'm gonna add in my gluten-free stock cubes. Did you know that North Stock Pots and Cubes are gluten-free except herb infusion pots and reduced salt cubes? And a pinch of nutmeg. And the nutmeg just gives it a really nice flavor, a slight twist with the dill. So now I'm gonna add my leeks and I'm just gonna pop them into the sauce. And then you just want to mix this in together so it's nicely incorporated into the sauce. If you make this dish at home, I really would love to see your photos. So please post it to your Instagram and hashtag glutenfreeweek and celiac week. So now I'm going to assemble the fish pie. So I'm going to put in the cod, just flake it up. And you want to evenly distribute the cod and the salmon. Just pour that around. Place the eggs on the top of the sauce and then I'm going to top the pie with this lovely creamy potato topping. So this is the final touch to my fish pie. I'm just going to give it a little bit of an artistic swell on there. Give it lots of love and what you put in is what you're going to get out and when you taste this fish pie you're going to be really happy. So there you have it, my delicious warming fish pie.